Hey gang, Danny here, and uh, today's episode is going to be a bit of a um, grinding episode because we need money. Um, we definitely need uh, money for at least a warp wire. I will probably try to build up a bit of a bank balance before exploring more into the dungeon. Um, simply put, like we, we can't go in... Like, we need to be able to go in and actually be able to have an escape plan. Like, you should never leave the, uh, leave a dungeon without the warp wire. Besides, I think my characters could use a bit of a level up anyway, so... So that's what we'll do today, is um, we're gonna level up and we're gonna... You'll notice that the FOE near the actual start of the dungeon is now gone, so that's good. Oh yeah, it was actually a mistake I meant to fix on the map. I noticed it last issue. There. Alright, cool. I do want my map to be somewhat accurate here, so... Alright, we need to get rid of the poison flies first, because we'll be able to kill those things off in, like, one turn. Uh, yeah, let's use Crush on this thing. We'll attack with him straight away. Maybe use some fire as well, and uh, we'll use Duffy's cure on Tarkus here. Nice, okay. Right, custom. Right, so let's have a little look here. We can get cure level 2, which is 10. TP. You probably need a bit more TP for that, if I'm being honest with you. To get TP regen, we need to be like level 10 TP. Probably should get that at some point. But right now, we want Unbind. Because um, at some point, um, like uh, we're going to need to unbind our characters and stuff. And If I have the ability to cure status element of a character I'm going to take it because like you know like is if there's anything that cures poison like I'm definitely taking that <laughs> poison is a uh, really 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 bad news to our characters uh, let's two shot you let's see how much damage that does Now these guys aren't too bad, so they, do, they do pretty reasonable damage, but it's not the end of the world kind of stuff. Uh, let's see if we can kill Tarkus. I doubt she'll get the chance to before the bunny rabbit dies. Again, like we're not looking to push super far into the dungeon here. Like, we're, we're low on supplies, so... I believe the thing over here... is dead ends. Yes, okay. So... Let's just, uh... Okay, so we do that. Now this guy is going to be as annoying as possible. Yeah, let's tr try to true shot one of these um, things as quickly as possible. The Strider gets hit with poison. Oh, Taka's got hit again. A 
but that'll probably be for that. Uh, here's Tarkus again. <laughs> oh, mate. I have to remember that Tarkus is actually kind of slow. Maybe this will go around like that. Alright, before we do anything, let's start healing. Oh, I'm actually running low on healing supplies, that's not good. Okay, this thing's gonna chase us, so we're gonna need to, um... Ah, yeah, I figured as much. I, I actually, um... I didn't actually map this area out properly. This goes around like this, I suspect. Okay, let's just get rid of these fucking things. Right, we're definitely going to need to go back to town after this, so... Because we are low on, um... We are definitely very low on, uh... Stuff here. But I just wanted to explore this area. So I don't like having parts of the map unexplored, so... Because I'm a little weird like that, I suppose. So this part of the actual dungeon is actually pretty explored now, so that's good. Um, once you know what to do with those white crystals... Uh... Alright, I want you to get rid of this thing and I want everyone else to lay into the cellar guy. Tarkus and Vash almost leveled. Right, let's uh, cast some more skills, shall we? Ah, uh, yeah, it sucks not having money, man. Like, I might actually need to do some grinding off camera. Because I think it's going to take me a while for me to recover from effectively having no money. Because you've got to remember, like, every time I go to the inn, I've got to spend, like, 70, 50, 60 bucks on that, so... Okay, isn't poison everyone this time. You can just lay into the sink. Kill all these skills. Prevent from doing that. Hey, Vash leveled. Nice. Okay, so. Sorry, I meant to click custom on that then. Let's see. Um. We want to get Warcry. We want to get that stat buff, so... Um, besides, like, you know, having our deep melee DPS guy do more damage, I, I don't think it's necessarily a bad thing. Um, we'll go for a nice little jog around this loop here. Okay, Tarkus is actually almost dead here, so... I'm going 
in it. Um, because again, if anyone goes down, it it is a problem. Um, uh, I went to click skills. They're getting bamboozled now. Nice. Okay. You could also use some more like regular healing potions. Not a ton of them, but like enough. I do want Tarkus to level though. Let's two shot you. Let's have you Bible this other guy and then you attack this guy. Of course they hit Tarkus. Now the poison doesn't take effect until the round's over, so. Nice, okay. So we managed to quickly kill them before they uh, fucked up Tarkus even more there. Now we need defense up to level 3. So we can have a bunch of this stuff. Now parry's pretty good. Yeah, so basically what we want to do is um, provoke and parry with this guy. Yep, alright. So hopefully we have enough um we have enough stuff to sell. And there's a cast fire on it. We're getting out of here anyway, so guys shouldn't be too much of a problem. Okay, um... Let's check to see how many items we have right now. That's about 110 bucks, I'd say. Uh, we're gonna need a little bit more than that. So what we're gonna do is we're actually just gonna wander up and down this um this corridor over here until we get like into some fights, I think. Because what we want to do here is, um, we want to fill up our inventory with like a bunch of stuff and then, then go back and trade for it. I think that's what we want to do. And these guys aren't particularly threatening, so... We did a little bit of exploring today, so it's not so bad. Um, Now these tree rats are a um, nice source of money, so we should be getting quite a bit of a payday from these guys. Uh, 
Uh, this guy isn't going to do too much of a threat. Uh, the reason why I'm doing all this grinding here as opposed to in level 2 is because um, at this point, um, Taka, like, we have no healing, so like if anyone goes down with fucks, um, you don't need like a crazy amount of money. We need enough money for a warp wire and a few healing things. I would like, um, I would like uh, more money to get some weapons and stuff, but. But I can maybe do that off camera. If if it gets too much, what I might do is, like, if I've recorded the episode and I think it's like a, gonna be a real boring watch, what I'll do is I'll just explain like, hey, listen, I've done this sort of thing. Because But it is what it is, like, you know, these games do occasionally require you to grind, especially if you take a couple of really bad losses like I did. Um, like, if I didn't get accidentally wander into these FOEs, like, I could sell the Nectar, but I don't want to. Um, that seems like a super valuable item. buy some stuff now. We'll buy um, one of your finest warp wires because we're gonna need that. We're short on supplies that you haven't been able to make is anything good. You find anything in the forest? Okay yeah so she's basically saying the same shit as before. Actually uh Are there any decent weapons now? Hmm, interesting. That's not that much of an upgrade though, that's the only issue. Nah, I don't think those um, medicines are actually worth it at this point. I'm just gonna s oh wow, it's 70 bucks to rest up now. Okay, well that's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you very much for joining me guys, I'll catch you guys soon, goodbye.